Life goes quickly, doesn't it? You can go your whole life collecting days and none will outweigh the one you wish you had back. Let me guess. You want to know why I tried to kill myself? Charles Chick Benetto A man who wanted to finish his problems, his depression, and even his life. Everything has a root, and for his suicidal attempt, the main cause is his loneliness. He first felt depression and guilt at the same time after the death of his mother, Post. Depressed of losing advices, criticisms, visits, phone calls, and whole mothering thing from his mom, which before have been irritated him, but now the things he misses the most. And felt guilty of lying to his mom before she died. It was his mom's 79th birthday party when his dad called, telling that there's a big opportunity for his baseball career. Since he chose to be a daddy's boy ever since he was a kid, he followed his dad more than his mom. And to make his father proud, he left his mom and the party and life that he has made a very important client. The next day, his mom died due to heart attack. And at the same moment, he was just playing for his career rather than staying by his mom's side till her last tried to convince himself that it wasn't his fault, but he ended up drinking much more than he does almost every day after that tragedy. Even his own family, his wife Catherine and their daughter Maria left him, or rather he left them. Then, until one day, he felt totally alone when he received a letter with two pictures taken from Maria's wedding. He looked at the name of the sender, which was Maria Lang, and not anyone Maria Benito. The envelope hasn't even have a return address. Why? Were they afraid I might visit them? He thought. Hello? What? Check. Why? Check. Listen. I wasn't even invited. It was their idea. They thought it what? was... What? Safer? I was gonna do something? I don't know. Oh, I'm a monster now? Is that it? I'm sorry. It's I wasn't invited to my own daughter's okay. wedding. Look, Chick, she's not a kid Never. anymore. And if she was worried... Yeah. What? Sorry, Catherine. Where are you going? Where are you going? Home. Lying in wet grass, he saw the truck his car crashed into. He didn't feel thankful for being alive like what others would say once they've survived an accident. He just started walking to get to their old house. Life is full of surprises, unexpected things are about to happen. As he arrived in their house, he didn't expect for that person to be there. Thank you. Where are we going? We're going to pay a visit. But first I want to show you something. Ma, what are you doing here? I live here. Not anymore. Then why did you come back? I don't know. 
at the house. You want to talk about this? Wait, 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 wait. You can't be here. Why not? Because you died. Oh, Charlie. You make too much of things. Come on. They visit Cruz, a regular customer of Charles' mom, at the beauty parlor where his mom works after his mom and dad divorced. They also visit Miss Thelma, Posey's co-worker in cleaning houses. Posey made both of them beautiful as what they asked for. And not long after, Charles knew that they will die soon as what his mom said. And they wanted to be beautiful for their one last day. And their last visit. Many nights your father didn't come home. After a while, I started to think he was spending an awful lot of time in the Collingswood store, so... One night, I followed him. What is this? She's pretty, isn't she? He had a girlfriend? A wife. That is a lie. He never would have done that. Nah, you're still defending him. I'm his son. One of his sons. I'm sorry, Charlie. He had the chance to spend one more day with his mom. The day which have changed the rest of his life. Forgiving his dad and giving himself one more chance to change and live to the fullest. There is a story behind everything. How a picture got on a wall. How a scar got on your face. Sometimes, the stories are simple. Sometimes, they are hard and heartbreaking. But behind all your stories is always your mother's story. Because hers is where yours begins. summer six years after we sat in those bleachers I want to make things right but they were the best six years we had together my name is Maria Lang before that I was Maria Bonetto Chick Bonetto was my father Every family is a ghost story. Sometimes the ghosts come back. Sometimes they never left. Mommy. I'm coming, Charlie. One of those nights